And I get the room next to the noisy ice machine for all eternity. And every day he runs by screaming, Fuck the FCC, this is the end of net neutrality. And every site you thought was so important doesn't, you can't really access anymore because your ISP's not Hey, gonna look at that, new textures. Let you. <clears throat> Oh, it's just the texture. They still haven't done the fourth game yet. What is that? SCP-684 just rampaging outside somewhere? Uh, sure. I don't know what you just said, but okay, let's go with it. You don't know... You don't know about SCPs? SCP-684 is... is We're being chased quite already. Quite possibly uh, an incarnation of Satan, but in massive, awesome prehistoric reptile that can't be killed form. Because there's another SCP that's quite possibly God, and is like not at all aware of 684's existence. And what like, are you talking about? SCP! Secure, contain, protect! Like, as in SCP containment breach, and the website that is based on. What is going on here? Uh, it's raining. Oh, is this the water level? It's the water level. <gasps> You're gonna have so much fun! It's not fun. There might be two water levels, actually. Or were those two different... Locked. Uh, ...game modes? <clears throat> Ooh, are there two notes? It's good to know that vision will be a mechanic in this area. Uh, research report 2. Whale 14D. It's the water level. Okay. Has strange small bite marks. They appear from another, another smaller mammal. That sentence isn't really accurate. But it's the strangest thing about them. But the strangest thing about them is their placement. They are in even rows inside the whale's stomach, all about five feet from the bottom of the stomach lining. What's this? Research report three. Whale 15A is still alive, but gets into fits of thrashing and is surfacing more often than natural. I think there may be a problem with its lungs, but I don't have any tools that would allow me to check it without it dying. I will have to allow it to die from whatever is causing it, and then do an autopsy. Why don't you put it out of its misery and catch the thing in the act? If it's gonna- if your plan is to let it die anyway- more notes. Cool. Excerpt 4132. And then I watched carelessly as the sea rose above the sky, casting waving shadows over the world. I saw the silhouettes of creatures, both familiar and forgotten, and suddenly I found myself falling upwards towards an ocean of darkness. The title came up, Kingdom Hearts. <laughs> Alright, so... Oh, there's a path back. Where have we not been? That's broken, of course. Why... Why put doors if they're gonna be broken. Research report 1. More whales are being shipped to the facility tomorrow. One for a health inspection and two that are already dead for autopsies. More and more beached whales keep appearing around those islands and I still can't find what is causing it. People. The deadliest predator. I don't know why I decided to say predator. With I, I'm still saying it like that. Research report 4. Whale 15D has <coughs> died much sooner than expected while I was away on holiday. I regret not being here, but I had estimated that it would live much longer. The team that did the autopsy... Is that supposed to be an orca? I think that's kind of big for an orca. Uh, the team that did the autopsy said nothing seemed to be wrong with the lungs, but that the stomach had a circular hole about two feet in diameter all the way through to the outside of the whale. This pretty much confirms a parasite is the cause of death. So that's supposed to be a whale. But what kind of whale? Uh, generic whale. Because I think an orca is a little bit smaller than that. A little bit. Not by much. Orcas are still big. 
Oh, that's a combination. What? Four, one, three, two. That was the excerpt, excerpt right? Yeah. That, that was a wild guess, but it was the only thing that I could think of that would fit. Five. The research facility is now in dire need of more engineers. We have a whole, <coughs> a whole block that is flooded and some vital staff are missing. We have a whole flock that are flooded. <laughs> a whole flock of engineers. <laughs> Alright, so... Oh, I I'm sorry. A herd of engineers. Of course yeah. I've heard of engineers. There's a whole flock of them over there. I guess this is the way to go? Uh, maybe it's locked. It won't open. I think the water is too high. So we gotta reduce the water level somehow. Those mechanics I are I would be fun. okay with reducing water levels. Aha! Uh -huh. Look, buttons. Well, oh, was that there before? Research report six. I hear a girl, or an animal, or something, singing to me, pleading that I come outside my locked room and let the sweeping waves comfort me. Brandon, why don't you go for a swim? It's so peaceful. Are you ready, Brandon? No, I am not ready. You should have answered yes. Look, it's the water level. Broken. Uh, you remember amnesia? Yeah. You remember the mechanics of amnesia? What specifically? Um, making sound in water. Oh. Oh. So, uh, join us next time <laughs> on Suga. <laughs> We're just gonna assume you die here. We've only gotten ten rooms, Brandon. We gotta go. Maybe it's not awake yet. Maybe we haven't triggered its existence. Uh, we may have triggered its existence. How so? Uh, does this room have an exit? Besides the way we came in? Nope, just that one. There's another door. There's a note in the water, I think. I love that going into the water doesn't uh, make like a splash or anything. Research report 7, all the staff is gone, only I remain. For no purpose, I remain here, resisting the call from behind the sealed door. But I will remain, as long as I can. Don't open that door. You got it, buddy. You open the door! So, I, ha I don't think it's in this area. It's probably... Behind the sealed door. The next Certain door, whichever door is next, that leads to the next area. Well, not that one. it's gotta be the one that the note said not to open, because... We don't know that that's the one. Maybe it floated away from a different one. Like the one we came, the sealed door that we came through to get here. It's locked. Alrighty then. One of those uh, rooms probably had a key in it. we test also if we can run through water? Okay. It's glad to know that water physics don't exist in this game. Yeah. It's Cause... glad to know. None of those are words that I it said. It is glad to know. <laughs> it is glad to know that Bruno Mars does gay. <laughs> does gay in the most exciting way. <laughs> oh, fuck. I used an article. Damn it. <clears throat> in most exciting way. There we go. Now I've done joke. There huh. it is. Huh. Wonder where the key is. <laughs> uh waste of time. Here we go. Uh, doors? 
this. What was that? What was what? I thought I saw something just appear. Or maybe it was just a box. Never mind. What? Turned slowly to the right. There, stop. You see it? Mm hmm. What do I do? Uh, not walk towards it. So, so are... it's the gimmick of this that it only hears you when you move in water and you can only see it out of the corner of your eye? Uh, I think that's just because of the, the, di the way the distance of the game works. Because for whatever reason, it's it's our vision is shaped like a cone going outward, so things further away but to the left are closer. I don't know. I mean, we can find out if we want. Yeah. You know? Oh, it's sitting on the box. <sighs> I don't think there are any boxes past here. Okay, there are boxes over there. Over there. Over there. What see, was the door uh, to see, our left audience, also? As I pointed... <laughs> we may want to test that before we activate her. Okay, it's broken. Thanks. Okay. Are there any boxes that we can maybe... Hop our way over to first. Over there, so... I think that one... Is that closer there? Nah. It's closer to that door. It's closer to that door, but that door is probably also broken. We can try. I can't see her anymore, damn it! She's still sitting on that box. If the music hasn't started yet, she's... I think we just... Okay. Fine. It's fine. You saying it's fine is making me more anxious than this, it's this fine. game. Fine. <laughs> <laughs> I bet you she activates after we go through the door anyway. Is it going to be another chase or is it going to be like some... I don't remember. Wonderful. <laughs> It may be a chase, all the boxes might not exist past this point, or we might go box hopping. She is continually facing away from us, which is comforting. <coughs> but she's also continuously turning around. Yes. Does she turn around to the other side? No. Only to her right. That's our, that, that is our advantage. She'll never look to her left. We just keep moving left, but the the angle she turns never changes. All right, she's probably gonna like scream and start some loud music, so be ready for that. Can we open the door? Can we go in? Are you too close to the door? I basically hug the door every time I go into it. Do I have to go up to her? Was the game not ready for us to be this cautious? Can we please open the door? Maybe we can step- GET IN THE DOOR! <laughs> okay. Up on the box? Maybe. Okay, yeah. I think this works like amnesia. Okay. Well, it's a healthy change of pace. Uh-huh. Then... Mechanics. Don't you love horror games when you realize that your death is your own fault? Okay, yeah, okay. Unlike Amnesia, it forgets where you are if you stop moving. Maybe she's deaf. And has incredibly quick, fast acting short term memory loss. Uh huh. Sure. Yeah. Let's go with that. Ah! Don't walk! Ah! At least she gives us the opportunity to heal up. Do not walk. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, do we just fast forward to full health? Uh, yeah, or let's just fast forward to full health. 
Oh, I guess we're going. <laughs> yeah, you it, show him. I didn't. I didn't click and bring it up. It just came up on its own. I I heard you click. Which one do you think? That one or that one? Left. Left? What if I get stuck on the corner? Well, then you're an idiot. <laughs> Just the one jump? Alright. Alright, I guess. 21 Jump Street! <laughs> okay. This is somehow both more terrifying and less terrifying than the other regular chases. Yeah. Yeah. Oh dear. Choices. Split branching paths. Um. Yeah, I think left takes us where we want to go. As usual in this game. See you guys. See? The door's broken. <laughs> okay. Whoop, 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 whoop. Oh, hi. <laughs> Smack. Why is there splashing water if it's just gonna be water? Also, where are these water particles going? Particles? Yeah, the, the, the particles on top of the water. <clears throat> Look, it's just a simple animation, okay? No. Little dots. They're not even going in the same direction. It's like, what? It's wrote. It's going around in circles. It's serpentining. What's going on? This isn't how water works. Well, water doesn't work. It's unemployed and lazy. Please stop, Miss Water Lady. You're making this go incredibly slow. Well, we could bullet. I don't see a box. Alright, there's the bullet. There's a box. Are your splashes getting louder? Splish, splash, I'm taking the bath. No wait, that's the this is music for meltdown at Madame Tussauds. Um Splish <coughs> Sham taking a bath. I wish I didn't have to do the What's their name? The the Dave Matthews band. I don't know what you're talking about. You don't know what the, the Dave Matthews band? I know what the Dave You young person <laughs> You whippersnapper. I'm four months younger than you. Fuck off. Mm -hmm. Why are you yellow, that makes me yellow the Aaron millennial. Of this group. Huh? That makes me the Aaron of this group. Of this group of two people? You're the Aaron? No, your girlfriend's the Aaron. Yeah. I had a revelation as I was lying in bed last night. Yeah. That I suddenly realized that Susie's, Susie Hansen's name was probably Susan. And that was a really weird realization to have. Susan Hansen of Kitty Cat Gaming. Stay in your box, Brandon. Jeez. God fucking. God fucking. Right? Right? I hate when I, I hate when gods fuck. Cause I make demigods and that just causes all sorts of problems. Get on your goddamn box. Oh, I sang I sang about it earlier and, and the, I didn't like. I meant to talk about that. No, no, you. Why okay. would you swing your axe a bunch and then try to run with no stamina? <laughs> I forgot I clicked. 
<laughs> uh, okay. To any of you who still have the internet service to watch this video, the FCC has um en en ended net neutrality for the time being, as the pro net neutrality people are saying. Which is which really sucks. What? Why would you go next to us? There are... okay. We can no longer predict where the boxes are. Alright, time to go. Alright, do not run immediately after that. <sighs> How long does this go on for? Are we supposed to just be running? I mean, I feel like that's all you can do. That's just like, just like, get to the box, stop long enough to figure out where the next box is. That's good game design. No, no. No one said this was a good game, just a good horror game. There goes my apple juice. Hashtag Dark Souls. <laughs> those are... Do you have any more of those in the, uh... Ready to be released yet? Or ready to release? No. Um, recorded at all? No. Because those are fucking hysterical. I, have, I haven't recorded any more Dark Souls 1 ones. I had a different game that I think I'm gonna do video for. This is the wrong way. It's just ignoring us. Okay, there we go. Why is it ignoring us? Did it glitch? Did we beat it? Did I win? How confused are you, pool I'm... monster? Oh, you're talking to the pool monster, not me. Yeah, the, the, the water thing. I am very confused. The whale killer. Isn't that the protagonist's name in, uh, the, uh, Force Unleashed? No. <laughs> whale killer. <laughs> there are no whales in, fo in Star Wars. Space whales. Space whales. What about that one weird whale opera in, uh, uh, Return of the Sith? Or Revenge of the Sith? The whale opera? Yeah, there's like a fucking whale opera where Darth City's like. Have you heard the tale of Darth Plagueis the Wise? It's a sad one. You would not believe your eyes. Have you heard the tale of Darth Plagueis the Wise? <laughs> uh. Save Padme as I fall asleep. This is different. I don't hear the splash up. Splashing we're free! -ish. Yay, we're gonna die. Still got like 70 rooms to go until we're safe, right? Wait, we might end. This might be the finale. Guys, we can you imagine if this were the finale? We you would not believe your eyes. <laughs> if 200 fireflies. Only 200. 200. Uh, how long have we been going on this episode? Because I feel like... So we get to a save point. Uh, that's that's our rule of the... Of the uh, room du jour. That's not the right. Bonjour, room du jour. We just, we just took too long with the, the thing before we realized, oh, this mechanic is pointless. Hello. And we've seen that now. Finally starting to affect me. Nine th this place has finally rooms. started to fuck me. Yeah. <laughs> I've been waiting <laughs> patiently. <laughs> Open and willing. Hi, Mr. Brainiac. Didn't this thing give us a code? Yeah. One, two, three, five. I don't know what that means. I'm sure there's some meaning to it. No. <laughs> Say hello. What new horrors await us? More empty. What? Oh. What? Oh. 
Look, a stripper pole. Go, Brandon, go. What? What was that about? What? I saw, like... There, there, there were crates, I'm like... They're just I... boxes, man. Yeah, uh, but I could hide down. behind crates. Just means that we're being... I could hide behind the... What's up with all these stripper poles? Strip society. What do we need? Alright, so it's not going to stop us halfway as I thought previously. One, two, One, two three, three, five. five. It's the same code. Got it. It's 35th of December. Hello? Yay! This is one of the first ones, right? Things to run away from. I don't know. Oh. oh. The ink is on the floor, so yeah. What is that supposed to be the sound of? Somebody vomiting ink on the floor? Uh... Hello. At least this will motivate us to get to the save point faster. No! No! Ah! No! It's that alien thing, right? That, that ink guy. Bendy. The... <laughs> Have Bendy you that? was just a devil thing. Have you played that game? Was I have not. The game itself doesn't really interest me too much, but the style of it does. So. I mean, I mean, I only know about that because I watched the game theory on that. But I mean, yeah, I've seen some YouTubers play it, and it's kind of just like a cinematic that you walk through. You don't really do a whole lot. So kind of like Telltale. I don't know what that it, is. Any Telltale game, ever? Oh, um, no. Oh. But it's just like things happen around you and like you collect things to... You, uh, you to don't really affect plot, do you? Mm, not in the first couple of chapters so much. But there's not a whole lot of like decision making on the player's part. Like here. You have to solve this puzzle. There's no s puzzle solving in Bendy. See, you got, there you go. In solving it is less sitting down and thinking about it more. Here's yeah. just to keep bashing your head against the puzzle until it solves itself. <laughs> no. There, you memorize certain patterns. <laughs> patterns. <laughs> it's not like random. They're, they're like different patterns that it randomly chooses, but it doesn't just go, I'm gonna randomly say this one, then this one, then this one, then this one. I mean, yeah. It... Yeah. <laughs> yeah. No, that's it. Yeah. Um, yes and. I just went yes. But Bendy and the Ink Machine, it's just like, here, you have to collect these, in the first chapter at least, you have to collect these six objects. There is no difficulty in collecting these six objects. It's just, like, symbolism or something? I don't know what, it, what was intended. But you didn't sit down and figure out the author's purpose? But the music is cool, and the game theory was alright. Thank you. Right. Uh, I, I appreciate your opinion. Say. I do disagree with it, but uh, I appreciate that you are entitled Boris to have has an no opinion. guts because you replace them with mechanical strain. Okay, I'm gonna say in advance. If we die in room 199, I I am not responsible. 199? How are we even gonna get there? Or 999? I I am not responsible for whatever happens to your computer. Um, please. Whoa! Okay! <laughs> hey guys! Hey. Next episode you can check out the finale, but we are done here now, I guess. In order to survive this house, I need to keep writing notes. I must do everything a central <laughs> protagonist would, and hope that this is one of those stories. Insert obscure horror reference that no one gets and misinterprets as instructions somehow. What? Bye! Are we supposed to be taking notes?